Hey guys, Mr. Polo here, and today I'm going to do an unboxing of the 160th scale high grade Levitane version IV. Alright, here is the box itself. Now, this is my second take on the unboxing because uh, I was talking a little too fast, plus the fact that I took a little longer than usual to make the unboxing. I was talking too much, basically. So, yes, yeah, so my unboxing. So, here is the Levitane itself. Well, um, I've been really excited to get uh, get this ever since they first announced it on the some kind of hobby show in Japan. Like the, I wasn't in Japan, but I was. I saw like images of, of it, and I was, I was really hoping to get it. And finally enough, I got a Levitane. I'm really happy with that. So it's good. Now, um, just like the Arbalest, I don't have a lot of knowledge of food on my panic. But unlike the Arbalest, the time the time when I got the Arbalest a model kit, I did my research, so I know somewhat know what's going on with this uh, mecha basically. And yeah, it's. It's an interesting model. Like I, 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 I don't want to like keep building Gundams all the time because you know Gundams. Like I know Gundams is my main thing, but I thought to myself, well, you know what? If let me try other model kits. Like it's not not just Gundam. Let's take it. Let's try different different uh, mecha in general. I do have like, yeah. I if you remember from my Facebook post, I did I did got an uh, Omega Mon model kit, a Digimon reboot Omega Mon model kit, and it was also called also Omni Mon in America if, if if I remember. But yeah. Uh, I want to try different different uh, mecha designs. So this is this is like something just to like try it out or something. But I know that I, I'm really happy with Arbalest, so I'm having high hopes with this uh, model kit as well. So let's go into boxing. So yeah, the box art, ooh, that is really nice. Like, like I, I don't, I've never seen gun gun high grade gun 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 plug like it's just, it's close to this kind of kind of a style. Like each gun has own like different style of like drawing art, but this one looks pretty interesting. Like. If, you, if you've seen it in the shop, you perfectly want to just, oh my god, I want to get this. It's very similar to Arbalest as well. Arbalest is like, similar in design, not I mean, similar in the style, so I just, which catches your eye. Alright, let's go to unboxing. And yes, it does have the official sticker from uh, the, I guess, manga manga company, so it's official. Alright, let's go to unboxing. So, on the side, we have the stuff you can do and stuff you've got in here. Basically, you got the Lambda Driver Canceler, which is... um. Yeah, I know what the Lambda Driver is. I did, I did say that in my Arbus re review that you know, it's some kind of a f system where it changes the willpower of a me person into energy. So, the Lambda Driver Cancer, you, know, you, you get a point, basically. And the gimmick was basically the hip hip joint come, come down. And um, I've seen like some re reviews from Gunaholic TV and um, was, like, a couple of ta like Taiwan YouTube, uh, Taiwan Gunplay modelers. Uh, they said that like. Okay, I've seen how it works. Like, it's not like it, it's the. I'm gonna tell you straight right now that it's not the same as the Arbalest. Uh, the Arbalest, like the way the way how this hip joint moves on is different from the Arbalest. It, it, this is I feel this is more better than the Arbalest if I put it that way. And then you get the weapon. Basically, you get a, a new weapon, basically exclusive to the uh, the Bandai Levitane, which is pretty interesting. And yes, the weapons you get the demolition gun and the monomolecular two monomolecular monomolecular molecular cutters. Yeah. And on the side, you've got the uh, promo, promo image of the anime uh, Full Man Invis Invis Victory. I watched a couple of episodes and yeah, it's alright. I mean, I, I didn't catch up most of it, but I just watched a couple of, first couple of episodes and like, yeah, not too bad. It's pretty pretty interesting. And yes, it retails for a whopping price of 3,600 yen. And yes, I, ha I have to admit, um, it's very funny because the, the, the hobby store usually go to uh, prices them like based on you know the, the yen price, but this one's a bit different. It's given by the uh, the like the supplier of the shop. So because uh, I, I'm not sure if I mentioned this, but the supplier in my ho hobby store has changed. Like so, has the, the supplier the the bleh, 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 start over. Um, the supplier. Of my shop, I usually go to has been changed. So this is the reason why they actually give a different price from the other hobby store. So that's which is the reason why uh, this this got delayed. Like it didn't it didn't arrive on on the same day as the uh, um, other hobby store. So yeah, let's go to the boxing. First back, we've got the uh, white part C plates, which is the white armor and the stickers. Yeah, I mean they're they're not too bad really. I can I I'm not I'm painting it definitely, so it's not a huge deal for me. But if uh, these stickers are alright, like they're they're fair they're fine. Uh, the only sticker I feel that's not good is the uh, the crest on the head. Basically, it's in grey, and you have to paint it orange and white. Like it's, you have to do the masking. But so if but but it's fine with me. I, I can paint, so it's perfect fine with me. Yeah, I guess that's fun. Next pack we've got the. I just realized. Uh, wow, well, I just realized. Um, the the runners. 
are really small. Like, they're even smaller than the, like, the gun, Gunpla models. Like, even compared to high grade, this is really small. Like, I'm not sure why they didn't use the, uh, uh, multicolor, multicolor runners for, multicolor runner, runners for the full man pancakes, but, and, yeah, all the full man pancakes from Bandai are small. Like, and, yeah, they're, they're that way. I, I don't know why, but it's, as long as the multi works, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. So, seeing, um, you got the, uh, cooling fibers in Cleario, that's pretty good. The e plate with the manipulators and other parts. And then the, yes, this is, this is what I like about the Bandai Devil Saint. These are all the uh, striping that goes on the limbs. Yes, I'm. I'm really happy that Bandai actually put the effort there to do that. Uh, if you remember, if, um, I did see reviews of the uh, Kurabukiya Kurabukiya uh, version and the Aoshima version. Okay, the Kurabukiya ones don't have, don't have any don't have any detail on it. It just they give you like that. You have to paint yourself. The Aoshima one well, not as bad. They give stickers for that, but over time they may peel off. The Bandai version, plastic. That's really good. I like that. So cute, that Bandai. The G plate, which is. All the joints and the, some of the weapons. Two of them. The polycaps, which are the exact same from the Gun Gundam uh, Gunpla models, the uh, Hydra Gunpla. So, yep. And B plate, which is the uh, some of the more armor. And in the back, the H plate, which is the um, mostly the um, what's it called? Oh yeah, the uh, demolition gun and the gun howitzer mode, basically. And next bag we got the D2 one with all the brown the brown. Yeah, that's hollow, that's not great, but it's alright. I mean I'm I'm pretty fine, but if you if you're planning to paint this you might want to plug that in. And yeah, you get the D2 plate with all the brown parts and the A2 plate which is the um the I'm not sure what color is it. Vermilion, yeah, vermilion. Oops, sorry. And yes, uh you get a D1 A2 paste. This is just a clear that. Right, let's go on to the manual. Uh, no, no, uh, some instructions, which is weird. I, I remember the other came one. Okay, and yes, the box, the, the manual. That, that, that is one nice thing manual. I have to admit, like, how, can can the uh, hikers get better, do better uh, uh, instructions than this? Come on, it is nice. And yeah, basically yeah, the instructions, um, the usual stuff. And in the back, you got the uh, details about the arm slave. Which is, yeah, um, we got the weapons and the mech itself, and then, yeah, the, uh, yeah, it's Alp, it's Alp is the AI of the, um, the Arbalest and the Levitane. And you get the color guide, so if you want to paint, go ahead. So yeah, that's my unboxing of the high-grade Levitane version IV. I am really excited to build this, uh, yeah, I can't build this immediately because I have school right now. And oh yeah, by the way, it's, uh, just notice, the... Striping, sorry, the striping that goes on the limbs are in that, uh, uh, that, that, uh, orange just, uh, that I see on, like, some models, some models. I'm hoping it'll go in the back. If, I, if it does, I'll put, in, uh, put a little, uh, title here so you guys know. But yeah, so unboxing. Thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing. Uh, I will build this once the holidays come, and yeah, stay tuned for, uh, for more videos. Peace out.